The freight database supports our overall freight forecast product. Uh, it provides a lot of monthly data uh, to a bunch of different transportation modes. It covers truckload, LTL, railroads. Railroads are actually on a weekly basis. Uh, it also covers uh, air cargo and port activity. And some of the unique data sets that are in there that, that uh, are not widely available include LTL tonnage on a monthly basis. We've been tracking this for a long period of time from the public companies. Um, <clears throat> that's not really available anywhere else. We've got a dozen of the biggest North American ports uh, that we track on a monthly basis that uh, um, gives us about 80% of all container import and exports out of, out of North America. And we've got weekly rail data by railroad uh, covering all seven class ones uh, for about the last 20 years. And, and so we think uh, <clears throat> these are some of the unique data points that uh, um, that go into our overall freight forecasting, um, but should provide some some value on their own to our to our customers. Probably the biggest benefit is is just to help our customers to keep up up to speed with what's happening in the transportation industry. The potential subscribers to the freight database could include anyone from an investment analyst who's who's looking for data uh, to a shipper to a. a logistics professional um, to a trucking company who just wants to understand everything going on in their industry. So the complimentary reports to the freight database would, would primarily be the freight forecast report, but also the truckload and LTL databases as well. If you're interested in subscribing to the freight database, please click the uh, button below or give us a call at 812-379-2085.